In this New Holland video, we will be looking at how to set up custom legends within New Holland's MyPLM Connect Farm tab. The custom legend feature allows you to create application, seeding, yield dry mass and yield wet mass layers, as well as the new yield moisture layer. We will demonstrate how to use the new yield moisture feature which has been created to provide another option when analysing post harvest data. Log in the farm tab and select setup. Click on Resources, then select Custom Legends, the next level down on the far right of the screen. Any layer templates you have already created will be listed on the screen. These can be edited or deleted, or a new layer type can be added. We will be adding a Yield Moisture layer, which will be automatically applied to any future harvest data of that crop type within your account. This new feature allows a quick visual comparison for data of the same crop type when viewing multiple fields. Click the Add button, bottom right of screen. This displays the custom legend detail and breaks option box. Select the yield moisture layer type. Select corn as crop type. Note that the yield moisture layer does not require you to select the measurement unit as percentage is the only option. Create breakpoints by clicking on the plus button until we have the desired number. In this example, five. Enter the break values. It is advisable to leave the first and last break values blank to allow for the full range of data to be displayed. We will use 10% for break 2, 12.5% in 3, 15% in 4, 17.5% in 5. Colours are automatically assigned to each break, however you can easily change them by selecting a colour square and clicking on the down arrow which provides an expanded selection of colours for each range. Once you are happy with the colours, click save. When opening the previously viewed yield map, or after editing your custom legend, you'll have to select Reprocess for it to repopulate with the new legend. This may take a while. Applications for this type of information could include variable rate application of seed and fertilizer by using the historical yield mapping information that includes grain moisture. A grower, for example, might decide to plant at higher rates in the areas of historically higher grain moisture levels to allow for earlier harvesting as the crop in those areas would dry down quicker to match the rest of the field. Thank you for watching. If there are any questions, let us know here at New Holland's Precision Land Management Team.